the main difference is that we manage our resources in a collective way and with the spirit of sharing what we have and at the same time just managing the resources for what we need and, and, and not for other purposes like personal uh, benefit. So I think that's that's a big difference because Western uh, system more, more provides for the individual interest and individual way of, of accumulating wealth, which is not the indigenous way of, of thinking and valuing resources. Yeah, if you look at, for example, forests, uh, the way we manage forests also relates to the kind of, of things that we do in the forest that provides us what we need. But at the same time, we make sure that the forest is protected. So we do what, what we call shifting cultivation, for example, where a lot of people think that, that it's, it's not a good uh, system. But we're able to prove that it actually provides for food security, it, provides, it, it enhances biodiversity, and, uh, and the forest is protected. So it's actually a, it's an ecosystems approach where you don't look at the elements one as separate to the other. That's exactly what we're saying, that you have to look at the ecosystem, the system as, it's, as it relates to the human being, right? You don't look at it in separation and look at their values only on the commercial sense, but it's its relations and its, its values also on the social, cultural uh, dimensions. And I think that is the one that is also missing out now. If, if we apply it at the global level, what we need now, because the carbon problem is a global problem, right? Uh, so, so we cannot, we, uh, uh, we need to see how there is, how those who cause the, the problem will take a bigger responsibility and at the same time allow the others to still develop in a sustainable way. So it's a shared responsibility, but at the same time, those who have caused it will have to get the, get the, the bigger burden. And all of us will have to be guided by a sustainability, sustainability framework of thinking that we all have responsibilities to protect Mother Earth. And each of us will have to do our own share in protecting Mother Earth so that the future generation has something. It has to be approached at the global level. And I think that, that, has all, that should always be where we should be coming from and not, okay, okay you handle your problem and we handle our problem that will not work.